Alrighty, let's turn now to the blue and gold. The Pacers faced off against the Bucks in Game 3 of the playoffs tonight. Gamebridge Fieldhouse was filled with a sea of gold, with the Pacers winning 121 to 118 in overtime. It was a nail biter. The Fieldhouse was electric, especially when the crowd saw the Fe Fever's newest star, Caitlin Clark. There she is, cheering on. The Pacers on the video board. 2024 has been a huge year for both the Fever and the Pacers. And as CBS 4 Scarlett O'Hara shows us, all eyes are on the Circle City. Basketball fans filled the streets and bars near Gainbridge Fieldhouse tonight with two big reasons to be excited. Let's go! Pacer season is lasting a bit longer this year, and you could feel it in the air downtown Indianapolis. And great leadership all the way around. I mean, we got Neesmith out there, dog. We got Halliburton, dog. We got Siakam now, <laughs> dog. Brings me back to my childhood when Reggie Miller was putting on a show, kind of in my college career when Paul George was putting on a show. Now it's great to see Tyrese Halliburton and company do the same thing. Plus, a very special guest appearance only added to the experience for fans watching playoff game three. I actually heard that she is starting the engines tonight, baby. Everyone, start your engines. <laughs> Caitlin Clark has arrived to the Circle City, bringing even more attention and business right here. So we love the fact that we're getting Pacers in late April going into May and then immediately maybe even at the same time having that Caitlin Clark fever uh, coming around as well. Sports bars like the District Tap are enjoying the crowds and everyone we talked to said it's great to see so much support for both our hometown NBA and WNBA teams right now. We thought we were close to maximizing what the fever we're capable of by bringing in Aaliyah Boston on the team, uh, but having Caitlin Clark definitely elevated it to a whole nother level. Having both of them on the same team is a is a pretty large draw that brings a lot of people in, so we're pumped. Go Pacers, go Fever. It's great to be in Indianapolis, great to be a Hoosier. With the Pacers playing another playoff game on their home court on Sunday, we can expect just as much excitement here in a couple of days. Reporting downtown, Scarlett O'Hara, CBS 4 News. The Pacers and the Bucks meet again on Sunday for Game 4 at Gamebridge Fieldhouse. A Major League Soccer.